Nobody to play to like Kentucky folks. Go, Linda. They said they are ready whenever I am. I am ready right now for them. A great big mandolin farm welcome. These guys are coming all the way, uh, 19 hours, to get down here to play for you tonight. They're from Branson, Missouri. This is Goldwing Express. <laughs> Kentucky. <laughs> Woo, last night we was looking at Canada state patrolmen face to face. 
Boy, I was ready to get out of that bus after having him drive. Wow. I tell you what, we outrun 28 highway patrolmen. Yeah. There's all in America trying to get here on time. <laughs> we did it, though. Hey, we did the unthinkable. Man, we pulled it off. We're just glad and uh, we're very proud to be a part of the music festival here. And uh, let me get you acquainted with everybody. Those of you that have not seen us before, we're all one family. And uh, maybe not one big happy family, but we're all one family. I'll introduce the guitar picker. He's a six stringer. How about a nice big Kentucky howdy for old Paul, our oldest brother. On the old doghouse base, that's our baby brother. I'd like for y'all to give him a big old Flemingsburg. Mandolin Farm welcome. Nice hand for Sean. And believe it or not, on the mandolin, this is our daddy. Do we look like him? No? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. How about a nice big howdy for Pop on the mandolin? He's no stranger to the bluegrass festivals around the world. We'd like to say what a nice job he's doing today. How about a nice big hand for Spanky on the fiddle? Yeah. All right. Oh, what a wonderful looking audience. Got one more son. Don't forget me. Son, I, uh, you've already introduced all my sons. One more. I'm really not sure you're mine. <laughs> How about a nice round for Stephen Joseph? That's my middle-aged boy. Oh, come on now. <laughs> All right, no more stopping. I, I no kinda, more stopping. I kind of think Spanky looks more like you than we do. I bet a secret be told. I tell you what, I went to a fair the other day in I, Missouri. I think at one time you were a milkman. I, w I went to a fair the other day in Missouri, <clears throat> and, and it was one of these, uh, uh, oh, what do you call them, where them, uh, uh, never mind, I'll tell it later. <laughs> To see King Pharaoh Told him to lose my people And let them go They were all burned down With trouble and doubt My God sent Moses And he led them out My Lord was sent to Moses To lead you out If you would trust him As you wonder about If you are burned down With trouble don't doubt My Lord was sent to Moses To lead you out Watching his waiting around To bind your spirit in close to the ground If you are struggling with it, pray on and shout My Lord will send the Moses to lead you out My Lord will send the Moses to lead you out If you trust him and you wonder about If you are burned down with trouble, no doubt My Lord will send the Moses to
That's worth the drive down here, boy. <laughs> Dad, what's the matter? Couldn't you get him up on stage? <sighs> 20 years ago, I could have. <laughs> oh, we love these fellas. I tell you what, these guys, one more nice round for our dancers. What a great dancing group. We have a real special treat for you. Now listen close. Let her go. Go ahead. Crying, holding to the Lord. Crying, holding to the Lord. face there, didn't we? Woo! <laughs> Honey, got it! Nothing like that wonderful, wonderful singer. I tell you what, that boy's got one of the greatest voices I have ever heard. Wow. Especially on a boy that age. Woo! I was going to tell you a while ago, I went to a freak show. You went to a freak show? <laughs> I went to a freak show the other day in Missouri. It's a great big state fair. They let me in free. <laughs> Imagine that. And inside this tent, I saw where they had a fortune teller. And there was a woman sitting there with one of these great big crystal balls. And I sat down across from her and she started rubbing around over that crystal ball. She said, ah. I see that you have one son. <laughs> I started laughing. I said, that's what you think. I've got three sons. She started laughing, and she said, that's what you think. <laughs> oh, mercy. Has it rained here? Has it rained here? Has it? It's over now. It's all over but the shouting now. And uh, Steve, I tell you what, you, you bring the dobo around, and uh, boy, I want you to play that thing because you're not doing much with the banjo, okay? <laughs> and uh, I love that dobro. 
Actually, that dobro was built in the state of Ohio. Hope you like this. Frank Carlo. Say, boys, here tonight on the Grand Ole Opry, we're gonna get the Dobro and we're gonna make it cry. And they'd get way up on the neck, they do the old style on the Dobro. You don't hear that much anymore these days, but I like the old style, and I hope you do too. Boys, here today in the great state of Kentucky, we're gonna make the Dobro cry <laughs> on the old great speckled bird. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, here yeah. we go. the boy's mama start dating again. Oh, you should see him try to pick up women. <laughs> I mean, after all, <clears throat> you can't leave merchandise like this off of the shelf very long at a time. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you what, <laughs> I'm so powerful. When I walk into them the hardware stores. Home Depot? No, them hardware.